You're on a cross-country flight from an airport where the altimeter setting is 30.07. Your destination airport has a setting of 29.95. Unfortunately, you get distracted and forget to reset the altimeter. If you've maintained a constant indicated altitude, is your altimeter reading higher or lower than true altitude? The following chart can help. I'll describe it as I draw it. The horizontal axis will represent pressure from low to high. The vertical axis will represent altitude also from low to high. Draw a vertical line halfway along the pressure axis. This line represents the initial altimeter setting. Next, draw a horizontal line halfway along the altitude axis. This line represents indicated altitude. Finally, draw a diagonal line starting where the axes meet and crossing where the indicated altitude and initial altimeter setting cross. This line represents true altitude. At this point, we can see that if the initial altimeter setting is correct, the indicated altitude and the true altitude should be the same. Now, let's demonstrate how this can help us with questions like the one at the beginning of this video. In the question, the initial altitude setting was 30.07. So let's label the initial setting line with 30.07. The destination altitude setting was 29.95, lower than the initial setting. So we'll draw a new line to the left of the initial setting line. We can now see that if the new pressure is lower than the original pressure, true altitude will be lower than indicated altitude, or put another way, the airplane will be lower than the altimeter indicates. Depending on the pressure differences, this could be very dangerous. If you'd like a copy of the chart with a few more questions and the answers, I've put a link in the description for that.